Hi, Noel Polanco here with HomeQuick. Uh, thanks again for checking out our web series here on uh, rules and tips for landlords. Today I want to talk about when landlords accidentally break the law. Um, many of you that are doing this on your own may or may not know that there's fair housing involved whenever you get into a landlord-tenant situation. The tenant has rights, just as you do, um, but their rights may supersede yours in certain cases. Uh, a lot of landlords that do this on their own think it's okay just to show up at the house to knock or to walk in the backyard, even if they say they're there just to do some maintenance or um, you know, fix something. You cannot do that. You've got to give a 48-hour notice anytime you want to come on the property. It's always best to send that certified. If you've got a good relationship for your, with your tenant, great, give them a call on the phone, but I would at least send an email too and show some kind of confirmation that they got it. Um, so unlawful entry is one of the, the biggest ways that people violate fair housing. Um, there's other ways that you can too when you're running their application, uh, when you're uh, deciding who you want to take as your tenant, you've got to be really careful about discrimination, um, making sure that you know the rules, you know what you can and can't say, and you know the reasons that you can deny someone. Um, one of our series earlier, we talked about the new rules for HUD for looking at criminal background searches. You wanna make sure you're clear on all of those new changes and those new rules before you make a decision. Um, so there's a lot of different things we can get into there, but usually the biggest one is landlords going onto the property or even sending somebody over to do work or to take a look at the place without prior notice. Make sure you're not doing it. Uh, for that info and more, you can always find me uh, and our company at homequick.com. Thanks and we'll see you soon.